<laughs> Welcome back to Tic Tac Doe. That dragon came on two times in a row. We cannot have that on my birthday. We hope we can get a win here. He's playing against our second place player in the last season. It is Boris Alexander. How you doing, Boris? Thanks. Well, you. Yep. So, last year you won $25. That is 90, what, Zlotties in uh, Poland money, right? Yeah. Well, what did you spend it on? Uh, I bought uh, one uh, one computer game, two books, and one DVD. Awesome. Awesome. Well, maybe you can win in the tournament and we'll get in second place in the tournament or probably win the tournament again, okay? Awesome. All right. Good luck to the both of you. We have Justin Ray playing against Boris. Here are nine categories we're dealing with, and they are the following. We have Harry Potter, Opponent's Choice, Monopoly, the 2,000 Pop Hits, Abbreviations, the $10,000 Question, Blackjack Blitz, our new category. It's a blackjack game. I'll explain to it, explain y'all about it once y'all pick it. We have the Jumping category and 2017. Let me unlock Boris's control now. Uh-oh. Well, you need to update your team viewer, Boris, but that's okay. I'll control the uh, jumping category for the both of you guys, okay? Sounds good. All right, Justin, which category do you want? We'll start things off in the center with uh, abbreviations, please. Okay, it's going to be a two-part question worth $3,000. And I will give you the extra time, okay? We have some long questions here, so pay attention carefully. Here it is. Okay. HD is the abbreviation for which type of media? That's the first one. Is it A, hard drive, B, heavy duty, C, high definition, D, huge damage, or E, none of the above? That's the first one. And the second one, HTTP is the abbreviation for an internet software. What is it? Is it A, hyper trademark of position? B, none shown here? C, handy, trendy, totable pockets? D, hypertext transfer protocol? Or D, head to this page? Here's the time to think about it. All right, Justin, which part you want to answer first? has such a catchy beat to it. <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> all right. All right. On a serious note, I'd like to answer both of them, please. Go ahead. All right. HD is definition. Correct. And then HTTP is actually hypertext transfer protocol. You got the center box. Nicely done, Justin. Thank we you, have, thank you. We have three thousand dollars in the pot and we shuffle. Boris, good luck. Yes. All right, Boris. Uh, uh pop hits, please. He's going with two thousand pop hits. Your question on two thousand pop hits. Which is the correct name of the band that had a two thousand one hit with here? Here's to the night again. What is the correct name of the band that had a 2001 hit with Here's to the Night? Is it A, E7, B, E3, C, E6, or D, E4? My answer is uh, E6. You said your answer was the answer? E6. That is correct. Good job. We have $5,000 in the pot and we shuffle. All right, uh, Justin Ray. Harry Potter, please. Oh, you want Harry Potter? Okay. Here's a question on Harry Potter. What condition do dementors represent? Again, what do what condition 
What condition do Dementors represent? What condition do they represent? Right. What condition do Dementors represent? Death? No, death is wrong. You're close. It's not death. The answer is depression. Depression. Uh. Depression. Okay, uh, $5,000 is in the pot, we shuffle. All right, Boris, your selection. He's going with 2,000 pop hits. Again, your question on that. Which artist had a chart-topping hit in 2002 with the song Complicated? Is it A, Michelle Branch, B, Shakira, C, Alicia Keys, or D, Avril Lavigne? The last option, Avril Lavigne. Say again. Avril Lavigne. That is right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. $7,000 is in the pot and we shuffle. All right, Justin. Let me do abbreviations, please. Gonna do for abbreviations again, second time in the category. Here's your question on this. PDA is the abbreviation for a handheld computer. What is it? PDA is the abbreviation for a handheld computer. What is it? Is it A, printed disc antenna, B, personal digital assistant, C, progressive Democrats of America, D, Pogo division armatures, or E, personal dividing all? is personal digital assistant. Right you are. Good job, Justin. $9,000 is in the pot and we shuffle. All right, Boris. <laughs> wow. Pop hits for the block, please. Y'all getting lucky shuffles here. Here we go. Pop hits. Here's your question. This is for the block. Which of the following Madonna albums was not released sometime during the 2000s decade? Is it A, American Life, B, Hard Candy, C, Bedtime Stories, or D, Confessions on a Dance Floor? That is correct. And you got the block. Yeah, that is correct. $11,000 is in the pot and we shuffle. All right, who? What are you gonna do now, Justin? <laughs> Let's do the ten thousand dollar question, please. Boldness here, the ten thousand dollar question. Now you get this question right on the ten thousand dollar question, the pot will go up to twenty one thousand dollars. Okay. All right. How many possible ways are there to get tic tac toe again? How many possible ways are there to get tic-tac-toe? Uh, <laughs> this is quite a question. Since this is just a question that's basically a wild... Time's up. Guess, I'm sorry. I'm going to say... It's time. Yeah, you took too long. I'm sorry. Uh, damn. Eight. It was eight. The answer was eight. You only get 30 seconds on the question. So, 11,000 is still in the pot and we shuffle. All right. Oh, wow. 
Well, what do you want to do, Boris? Side category. Uh, uh, you going with the ten thousand dollar question? Okay, get it right. The pot will be at twenty one thousand dollars. Here it is, Boris. Who played Clark Kent again? Who played Clark Kent? in the first Superman movie in 1978. Christopher Reeve. We put $10,000 in the pot, that's right. So we're up to, we're up to $21,000 in that pot and we shuffle. Oh boy, Justin, this board is getting interesting every minute. Justin. Jump in category to block, please. Gotta do it. Alright, I will control the jump in category. Now, whoever gets this uh, a question correctly, in this case, Boris, if you get this question correctly, you'll win the game. $23,000 and you'll be the new champion. Justin, you need it for the block and whoever answers the question and um and uh, miss the question. The other will get the box automatically with nothing added to the pot. So be careful. Um, Justin, you will yell X if you want to buzz in. Okay. Okay. And uh, thank you, sweetie. Thank you. That's okay. Thank you, sweetie. I got a birthday card, y'all. All right. Um. So twenty-one thousand dollars. Okay. So. Justin Ray, you'll say the X, you'll say X if you want to buzz in, okay? Okay. And Boris, you'll say O if you want to buzz in, okay? Okay. All right, here we go. Here's the question. What gaming company originally published the games Be Jilled and Pego? Oh, oh. Oh, X. oh yeah, that's uh, Boris, that's Boris. For Tic Tac Doe and twenty-three thousand dollars, which gaming company originally published the games Be Jeweled and Pego? Popcat. You have Tic Tac Doe. Good job. Good job. Oh yes. So Boris has twenty-three thousand dollars, and he's gonna go ahead against that dragon for one hundred fifteen thousand dollars in a second. Well, Justin tried to say that X. He said, "Oh." <laughs> and then the X, but that's okay, Justin. You still have thirteen thousand dollars. You're you're on the leaderboard, okay? All right, Rodney. Thank you very much. No and problem. Boris, congratulations to you. Well, well, Boris, you're back over here. You have twenty three thousand dollars. You ready to play against that dragon? Sure. All right, let's do that. Beat the dragon game. Here we go. Uh, all right, guys, and this card I just want to show y'all it says 39 again. 39 again with my age on it. So I love that card. That's a good card. Now, um, Boris, you know the rules of the game. You'll be playing for 100 and uh, I think it's 120,000. Now we'll check in a minute. And the prize package, let's look at that dragon one more time. Remember him not no more. We hope we don't see him again. And here's the prizes you're going for, boys. They are the following. We have a billiards table, a trip to Boston, a five-piece dining group, a trip to Auckland, New Zealand, a trip to Mazatlan, and a grandfather clock. And those prizes are totaled $28,346. Now, boys, if you find a tick and attack on any of your picks, we give you a hundred and fifteen thousand five hundred dollar bonus. If you manage to get it on the first two picks, it's two hundred thirty thousand dollars, and you have a shot and a new car. Okay, Boris. Six. All right, let's do this. We're gonna call, cover the board, and what's your number selection? Six. He's going with six. Let's see what's in number six. It's three thousand dollars. Okay, stop or go. Play. Okay. Uh, four. Let's see what's in number four. It's $1,500. You have $4,500. Awesome start. It's 
stop or go? Okay. Uh, nine. Let's see what's in number nine. A thousand dollars, you have fifty five hundred. All you need is forty five hundred dollars for the prize package. Stop or go. Play. Go ahead. Center. He's going with the bulls on number five. He only needs forty five hundred. Yeah, he only needs forty five hundred dollars and let's see. No, not again. Oh, that dragon was being lazy. You'll yeah. never defeat me now. Dad, this dragon is something else. Beating everybody. That's three in a row. Let's see what a ticking attack was. Wow, right on the diagonal. Three and seven. Yes, yeah, seven and three. So that was bad luck. So that means that the jackpot goes up to $120,000 or $240,000 if it happens on the first two picks. We're going to take another commercial break. When we come back, we'll do one more game of Tic Tac Doe. Stick with us. Oh, that sucks. I'm sorry, boys. Uh -uh. 